We got her uh, from somebody in Turlock, I don't remember because it was nine years ago. Um, when she was six weeks old. Mike Weed of Waterford said his pit bull Chevy means the world to him. She's a family member. So when Chevy went missing after the backyard gate was left open, it was devastating. We drove around town, we Facebooked, asking everybody. And just as Mike was about to give up hope, he got an email this week from the company his dog was microchipped through. They were requesting to transfer ownership information of Chevy, my, and it says your dog Chevy's chip information to new owner. After making some phone calls, he was able to track down Chevy to the Friends of the Animal Community Pet Rescue in Sonora, roughly 45 miles away from his home. But it was too late. She was adopted out to a different family. So in a world of microchips, you might be wondering how in the world could something like this happen? I reached out to the rescue shelter and the owner tells me they've been taking care of Chevy for the last six months. The animal rescue originally got the dog from the Tuolumne County Animal Control, where it had been for several weeks and was at risk of being euthanized. However, the rescue owner told me they never checked the dog's chip or tried to contact the owner because that responsibility falls on animal control. They had her for, for Six months, that's a huge communication breakdown. Now the rescue's in contact with the new family to see if they're willing to return Chevy to her original family. Here's her with a sprinkler. And Mike is hopeful they'll do just that. In Waterford, Giacomo Luca, ABC 10 News.